you've already downloaded the entire sound library for Logic, you may get this. See, so audio sound library files exist here, but it won't let you install it there or point to it. To fix this, we're going to temporarily delete the library that we have on our external drive. This is because we want to be able to move the library from the current local hard drive to the external location. And if it already has something there, it's not going to work. Okay, so now that we've deleted the library, put it in the trash, we can open up Logic again and look to try to relocate things. And when we do that, here we go to the sound library and we're going to go to relocate. Notice on the bottom here, audio, my external audio, we're allowed to relocate it. Awesome. As you can see here, I'm moving the entire library over, but you won't have 60 gigs to move over. Um, you'll just want to move a little part of the library. Now, what if you don't have anything downloaded yet? In that case, it's not going to let you move anything over because you haven't downloaded it yet. So go to Logic Sound Library and go to the Open Sound Library Manager. And here you want to pick something small. I picked the reverbs here, but you can pick anything like that or maybe the Essential Library and just download those so you have something actually installed on your computer. You need to install that um, to let you actually move it over. Okay, so we can see here that I have my library in the trash here and not on my external audio hard drive. Now I'm going to go over to Logic. I'm going to go to Usual Place Sound Library and Relocate Sound Library because I already downloaded some, a couple files here. And then I'm going to go over to Audio and click it. Relocate. Sound Library has successfully been moved to a new location. Sweet. Now the next thing we need to do is we need to replace the moved sound library. Let's see where that is. Here it says library. And inside of here we have logic, garage band. I just have a few things in here, not much. We need to go in and just replace this with the library we have in the trash. Okay, so let's do this. We first need to go to logic and quit it. So I already moved my library over there, it knows where it is. Quit. Now I'm going to go into my trash here, into my library, do the same thing over here in my audio drive. This is my small little library of a couple, a gig or so that I've downloaded. I'm just going to take all this here and I'm going to drag it over and just replace. Now I should have everything I need in here. And when I open up Logic again, it'll open up the files right here in the library. So let's open up Logic. And look at this. Everything's there. Well, I didn't actually download everything from the world. String instruments, apparently. So let's download the last two. But that's it. You can get everything you need back on your computer, even though it's kind of a pain.